Hi, my name is Pete Groverman. I am the president and co-founder of Tapinko.com. Tapinko is the online marketplace for offline ad space. We believe that advertising offline, such as advertising in magazines, newspapers, anywhere off the internet, that advertising offline should be as easy as advertising online. So what does that mean? Well, if you wanted to advertise in every newspaper in Philadelphia today, how would you do it? And the answer to that question is you have two options. So you can either A, contact each publication directly, or B, hire an ad agency or brokerage firm to place the advertisement for you. In any event, it takes about two weeks to place one ad in one publication for one issue. So ultimately, there's a disconnect between the buyers and sellers of advertising. In particular, the buyers have a hard time contacting the sellers and going through the transaction process that it takes to place an advertisement, and the sellers have to manage the content, the sales, and put out a publication. In any event, like I said, it takes a lot of time, and it's a, it's a pain in the butt. Well, introducing Tapinko. Again, Tapinko is the online marketplace for offline ad space. So what does that mean? It means now, if you wanted to advertise in every newspaper in Philadelphia, it's a question of checking boxes, picking dates, uploading artwork, payment, confirmation, done. What used to take a matter of weeks can now be done in minutes. And the real power of Tapping it comes that we've taken these things. These are media guides, four to six page packets of information that salespeople use to go out to the community to get sales. And we've taken these media guides and we've taken the most pertinent information and put them into profiles that are tied directly to our database. Now these profiles contain all the relevant information including the price matrix, the layout matrix, even a, a logo and some information about the, uh, the publication itself. But the real power of Tapping or the, or the tool sets that we offer to the publications it's gonna, we don't just make the job easier for the buyers, we make that whole managing side easy for the sellers themselves. And that tool set begins with the Advertise Here button. When that button's clicked, it takes that buyer through a very simple step-by-step -step process to place the advertisement. But that's only the beginning, because the tool sets that we offer are pretty comprehensive. And they include everything from a, a, a file, complete file backup, the seller statistics, to even this negotiation internal messaging component that has really um, taken uh, the, the, has, has set the precedent for, will set the precedent for hopefully how the negotiations, negotiations take place uh, between the buyers and sellers because it's no secret to anybody that the advertisements that are, or the prices listed in the uh, media guides are not necessarily the prices that end up being settled on. So we've included a messaging component that allows for the negotiations to take place through Tap Inco. So how do we make money? And the question we make, the way we make money is we charge a very simple transaction fee on the seller's side. So what does that mean? It means it's free for anybody to run a campaign or place an advertisement using the tapping service. So if Stephen Welch wants to advertise uh, Dream Adventures to all the college students in all the college papers across the country next year, it's as simple as going to tap and it won't cost them a penny. But so that transaction si uh, fee on the seller side is a one-time charge only when the, when the transaction takes place, meaning there's no one-time setup fees, there's no annual subscription costs. We only make money when the publications themselves make money. On board right now with us, we've got our, our beta schools who are in the university niche. These include the Harvard Crimson and the Daily Pennsylvanian and several others. Now, we, you know, the, the university niche and the, the student-run publications themselves comprise a $120 million market and there's 1,400 of them across the country. But this is just a stepping stone and the launching platform for us to go to the $176 billion offline advertising realm. The beauty about the advertising space is the fact that Sales are done in the same fashion, no matter what the medium, whether it's a, 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 a phone book, a Zamboni in this case, a magazine or a newspaper, they're done in the same fashion. They have these media guides, um, the rate cards, and the salespeople. And all we've done is we've piggybacked on this pre-existing um, way that advertisements are sold and given them the ability to now create a profile to help sell the advertisement. So where are we going with it? Year one, we're starting out with this college market, the weeklies and dailies that comprise that $120 million niche. That's going to be the gateway for us to go to this thing that we've coined as the college family or the college ecosystem. Any advertising on a college university's campus itself, whether it's the yearbook, the uh, alumni magazines, the med school journals, the law school magazines, whatever, wherever an advertisement can be placed, even the athletics departments or the transportation, we're going to go there and expand the, the, the tapping of platform to include those opportunities. Then, by year three, we're going to start um, scaling out to all the other opportunities that exist in the offline advertising world. These include the magazines, even the ability to go to the, you know, the outdoor world, like the billboards, and even possibly we, we're, we're looking to test the waters with the mobile and the online platforms itself. So we don't, don't just limit ourselves because really the way advertising is sold is universally done in the same fashion. 
By year two, we hope to be cash flow positive. That'll get us to the point then where we can build the product out to encompass all the other opportunities that exist offline. So what exists out right there right now? Right now, everyone in this room, I'm sure, is thinking of Google print ads, media bids, Ballyhoo, these, other, these, these, these companies that exist in this $176 billion market. But what do we do differently? You know, these other companies focus on the different individ individual segments of the process. None of them focus on the entire process, from the search to the confirmation. Media bids, for example, fo focuses strictly on the remnant space selling, selling of ad, you know, uh, ads and uh, helping with the, the, this auction-based component for the pricing. It doesn't really help too much with the, with the whole search and then the whole transaction, the graphic component, everything in between. So that's the one thing that Tapingo differentiates itself as, is we empower the entire process, not just a little segment of the process. In addition, you talk to any client of Google Print Ads and you say, How, what are your thoughts on Google? And they'll tell you the same thing. They say, Google's great. It, it's a passive extension of our sales force and it grabs us advertising that we would never normally captured. It brings in revenue to our paper. But what does it not do? What does it not do? It, it doesn't really help the pre-existing channels that the advertisement, the way advertisements are sold. And to demonstrate my point, this is Backslash Magazine. This is one of our, uh, our beta customers right now who's on board using the Tapingo system. And the way, what they've done is they're using Tapingo in an interesting way. And I'll, I'll hold it up, but you can come see it afterwards. But what they've done, and we, we didn't even pay them, they're running our logo with the ad and, and their, their, uh, their Tapingo profile link in the magazine where it reads, to advertise in the next issue of Backslash, go to tapingo.com slash backslash. So they're using Tap Inco to help and empower their sales teams and the, empower the entire process. So now when a, a salesperson goes out to the community and they say, hi, would you like to advertise us? Here's our media guide. Not only will the media guide have you know, how, to, how to place an ad and it gives you a step-by-step -step transaction process, but it can now include the link and the address to their Tap Inco profile page. So those are the, the two ways that really differentiate us from anything else that's out there right now. So on board with my team, I got myself, my two partners, and our advisor, Randy Angler. The four of us came to Dream It four months ago with this vision, this concept, some pretty mock-ups, and Dream It said to us, they said, we believe in this, we see the vision, we like it, we could have used this. Because <laughs> the fact, you can ask uh, Steve about Steve's experience about how, how difficult it is to get Dream It, the, the whole name itself, out to the community. So they gave us a chance and let us on board, and they said, we want to see a prototype, we want to see beta users, we want to see, see make it happen. And the last several months, we've done it. We got on board, these, these beta schools are gonna help us test out the, the product and iron out those kinks to make this product a reality and expand it. We've got, we've got uh, end user ca uh, test cases to see if this is something that people would actually use. And guess what, they will. In fact, when we walk into a college office right now, again, this is the, the niche we're beginning with, the vertical we're, we're starting with Tap and Go. When we walk into an office, within the first five minutes, these, these tech savvy young students who are running the publications get it, love it, say they need it and want it. It's that fast, it's that easy. And it's amazing, we only spent three days capturing these five publications, and then we started talking to the other publications because our beta, we, we can't handle that many schools for our beta, they're ironing this out, but they're waiting and they're excited to come on board. So at the end of the day, it's something that anybody can use, and uh, he's here today, but I built this product so my father can use it. <laughs> and that says a lot, because he's, uh, he's not the best with, with computers. And that's, that's the whole philosophy of Tapping goes to keep it easy. Let everyone with every advertising opportunity or everyone who wants to place an advertisement, give them the chance to do so. So what's it gonna to take to get this company to where we want? We're looking for a $500,000 investment. This investment's gonna help us refine the product to build it to scale to all those other uh, verticals and mediums that we wanna approach. In addition, we, were looking, we need help with the, the management team extending the marketing, uh, marketing portion of the company, which is certainly a, a real extensive push because we have to capture all those publications. And granted, there are those, those uh, conventions and shows, and uh, you know, it's, it's not proving to be too difficult of a way of getting them, but, but it's a question of approaching and, and expanding our resources so we can capture as many as possible in as aggressive as a time scale as we can. And uh, to share with you the vision of Tapping, the real power of Tapping, and where we're taking Tapping, is when you drove here today, and you were on 95 or 76, and you saw that empty billboard, what did that billboard say? It said, advertise here, call this phone number, right? Well now with Tapinko, that billboard can read, advertise here, and then have the, uh, the account number. And if somebody wants to place an advertisement on that billboard, it's as simple as going to Tapinko.com, typing in the account number, bam, the profile page of that billboard comes up, the traffic count, when it's available, how much it costs, who owns it, even a picture of it. And if somebody wants to place an advertisement on that billboard, it's as simple as checking that Advertise Here button that takes them through that step-by-step -step advertising wizard to help them place that advertisement. 
So at the end of the day, what is Tapinko? Tapinko is the online marketplace for offline ad space. 